Welcome. We are going to play Synthesis Universe, which I had a chance to do a demo of at the OC5, I think, Oculus Connect 5. Um, so two and a bit years ago, which I had a demonstration of in a hotel room with Ollie, Olivier, uh, or Oliver, not sure how he pronounces it. Um, and I, I saw it. it was really like music centric, very, very heavy. And I thought it was a pretty nifty indie experience. So he released his episode 00, which is like a passion project out to the world. It's available on Steam and on Oculus Home. And I'm going to play that for you now and just see what it's like. I haven't been back in this in a while. I think it's going to be a pretty like um, music laden experience. So no music here right now. And we're just going to do that when we get in. So that's the deal. That's the deal. Um, let's go ahead and try it. See, see, see what we think. I've got like this uh, pentagram selector in front of me. I mean, not pentagram, sorry. Pentagon. Well, these are uh, play and stuff like that, so. It's all gaze based, I suppose. I am guessing. I don't know that for a fact. But we're gonna see. Alright. Here we go. Oh, so I'm modifying them by looking at them. Very kind of dark. They look like Anubis. Oh, you need more music. All right, there's like leaves floating around me. The thing I'm gonna say as well, everything's really sharp. It's definitely like a music experience thing straight out of the gates here. So you modify the tonality and stuff the output by these five Anubi. I'm gonna call them Anubi because they look like Anubis. I think there were most certainly no motion controls when he started this project. And it's weird. I think it would be cool to even have like the hand tracking in there. Oh, well of course you don't have it in the headsets other than Quest, right? Whoa, what's happening? It's bizarre. I'm not sure what's happening here. That's blinking. Did I get all five? Why are those blinking at me? <laughs> kind of puzzled. Now there is a level of audio to the game, just like in the bass. It's very heavy, it's like a, a rumbling. I feel like it's asking me to stand still. And it's still rumbling. I'm not sure, do I fuse this together or something? Like, bizarre. And so far, I've had to look at things to kind of get them to move on.
They want us to go inside. Do I line that up? What the hell? God, my sub pack's going insane. I love this base heavy. And then you're like activating bits of this cog when you look at it. It's so weird. Like maybe I'm not supposed to be that close to it. I don't know. So I've like selected all of those. I see why people have compared it to Surge. It's very its own thing, but it's like a different... It definitely gets you grooving. What am I missing? It's gone sentient. <laughs> it's like that cube from Star Wars. Wow. I gotta say, the visual effects in this must have taken ages to work on. <laughs> They're really sharp, though. That's the thing, like, the polish on this is really nice. <gasps> Ooh, that's neat. That looks like a pig. An oil uh, pig, not a oink oink pig. What the heck is that? It's like inserting... Oh, that's like a virus insertion. Feckin' hell. This is like a music video. Oh, there's the SU guy. Uh-oh. Things don't bode well for him. He looks like he's about to, um... choke. Oh no! His head fell off. It's rather unfortunate. What the heck? This like this schematic thing that comes up. Do I have to rebuild him? What are we doing? I'm so confused. Oh my god. Hey cat, how's it going? This was one of those games you play when you're stoned? Yep, hundred percent. Hope you're doing well. Again, it's supposed to be like half hour journey I hope the audio is nice enough for you guys because I tried not to muck with it too much I didn't want to suppress it too much I gotta be careful because I'm like well and truly cabled. I've got four cables come to me. This is very metaphoric of me right now. There's cables. I've got four. <laughs> I got the rift. I got my my headset. I've got the sub pack line in. And then we got the sub pack under the wall because if its battery was depleted. So I'm running it off of mains. Um, I'm well and truly like strapped down. Nice seeing you, Cat, by the way. What's over there? What now? This is the thing, it's kind of like, like puzzles and music. What do I need to do? 
Let's show a selector. Look up. Sometimes it's like ducking or looking around. There's definitely something interesting over there. But it all seems to be kind of gaze based. Like wherever you're looking is what gets interacted with. I'm still trying to figure this out. Am I moving? It almost looks like it's moving slowly. Yeah, there we go. Is that the infection? That's the virus pod or whatever it was? Oh man, this is about to go cool. I get a feeling. What is that? Is that liquid? That can trip you. This is a synthesis universe, by the way. Oh, oh, that's... It really gives me a Tetris effect vibe. This music is pretty sick. Just the visuals are really neat. Oh, it's reminding me of something else as well. Thumper. Thumper Tetris effect. That's cool how it fades out when you're not looking at it. It's rebuilding itself. That can't be good. It's really a, it's like an, I like that people said that this is um, like a, it's like something You're losing me. is really enhanced by so packed. Cyber dog. Fucking lasers.
This feels like something you'd uh, see at like a art festival or like a Burning Man or some kind of showcase. Where are we going? We're getting bigger? Hmm. It just disappeared. Back to the schematic of something. I think this is now like, it feels like Paper Beast in this section. Like it really is picking up a vibe of several other indies as we go through. Just like a bit by bit experience. Here's the guy's head. The search begins. Missed that word. Music. Adventure. Synthesizers. Wow, none of this was in there. This is like hinting at the next episodes, because this was supposed to be episodic. So it's like a story told through a backbone of like music and stuff. But this is kind of the introductory episode, right? This was like the, do you want to see more? And loads of people were saying, like, yes, want to see more. Give me more. I think it took him like four years to put this together, though, so it's like, will there be more? What is that? Are these, are these the rooms? What are these? Oh, those are, those are rooms, right? I don't know what I'm selecting. Not that one. Blue Crevance, Drone Charge. One minute, teaser episode one. Okay. Now what's over here? What is that? Is that an exit? Feels like that was some kind of an exit. So this is Synthesis Universe, so... Are those both the same? What's that? Hmm. Try, I'll, I'll try the right side one. I don't remember if I did the, the right or the left last time. Not sure. Okay, this looks new. What is this? Okay, we definitely didn't see this part before. The thing is, it's, it's really aesthetically pleasing on the music side and the originality. Like, those are the three things that stand out to me. The visual appeal is really strong. Gives me a kind of like a Daft Punk feel, this one. Oh my. But I don't... I don't know what I'm doing. Um, I get the feeling that this unlocks something or should be something, but I can't tell what to look at. To my retina, straight in. <laughs> the thing is, without like hand controls or any kind of touch control support, I don't think there's touch control support. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I'm wrong. Oh. Did it have control support this whole time? And I didn't realize it? Whoopsies. What if I feed this to this? Can I feed you? Hmm. 
Not sure. Not sure what I'm doing. Oh. Oh, we did something like this. I feel like, whoa, what was that? Okay, we triggered something. Something's happening now. And this is like, um, oh shit, what's that film? Contact. Oh, they're rebuilding him. A lot of complicated scenes in this. This I can see why it took so much time. It's cool, but like, holy cow. I'll bet you a lot of this gets lost. Like people pick it up and aren't sure what it is. This is one of those casualties of the Steam refund process. Just people won't have the patience. And they'll just like, not even know that there's a second place to look. This reminds me of a website I saw once, which was all music integrated. Tokyo Machine, or Tokyo Drums. I'm trying to remember the name of it. It was awesome, great website. It's like heavy bass studs. That guy looks pretty happy, you know? He looks like a happy robot, like not a sentient murderer. Robot. I do like the music. What an experience this is. Eight pounds it is on Steam. That's ten dollars. Synthesis Universe. Kind of see it as like an introduction to like, if you like the concept. Spread the word. Yeah, definitely the closest thing. Thumper, Surge. What's that? Oh. So that's like the extra... At least I know I have some controller support now. I didn't realize that earlier. So that could change things. Just a little bit. Um... Okay, what if I, so we did the right one. What if I do the left one? It's just so weird. This is the story episode one. So is this just a replay? What is that? What is that? What's that extra thing? And there's somebody, is that a lady? Can't tell. Is one of them, I don't know. I think that's one of the like female, the fembots. Notes, seated play. Uh, fragment memory zero one. Oh yeah, yeah. I think we've done these. That's the teaser. That seems to have... See that? There's like another offshoot. Like we missed one. Have a look. All right, let's see if we can find this hidden... It looks like there's a hidden place. Can't tell. See, I do have... Bring your hands together and it like pauses or something. All right, we've done this. This 
definitely one of those weird ones. See, that was the that was the side step, right? That was probably the side step. Like, why can't I go there? That's what I don't understand. Um, okay. I, I can tell you I'm definitely gonna miss something here. But I don't understand. So there's those two guys. That's the turn it off. It's a little happy bot. I don't know what he is. And play just initiates the whole story again, I think. Oh, is there another one? Wait. Was there one on the right? The, the subtlety of the music in this segment is so nice. play this through again and then I just like this bit duck last time This is the bit that I kind of missed a little bit of earlier. This is the part where we're building the the, the engine that it, it, that puts the virus in. Now I'm getting it. It's like you're focused on all these like fun little mechanisms, and you don't realize you're building a virus. Virus injector. Look at the JMJ concert <laughs> concert right here. Probably JMJ inspired. The audio design's amazing. Nice, okay. So, I think if I go back, 
All right, hold my head still. Can't I go back? There we go. Oh, you have to take your head away again. What's that one? There's one on the right as well. Yeah, these are definitely different experiences. Okay. See, I thought I'd... Oh, okay, so I have missed a bunch. Like, I don't know if I would have known that. Hello, little glowing flower ball. Please don't kill me. I'm like in a large atrium with tree branches or arms extending from the Anubis eye. That's the plural of Anubis. <laughs> Welcome to the center of the Anubis eye. Yeah. That was odd. It was like a short little thing. Either that or I don't know what I'm doing. Music by Tammy Otto and Anthony Agunt. Okay. So we did that one and that one. What about that one we've done? What about that? Okay, this is... This is the same. So what is this? The fact is that I feel like I did it wrong. I feel like that's the exit or something. It's not, like I'm doing something wrong there. That's what it feels like. All right, we tried that one, we tried that one. What about this one? That one's dark for some reason. Hmm. That one's dark as well. Burn, baby. Not really sure. Hey. Load quote, thank you. What is that? You come awake, come awake, little guy? You wanna wake up? <laughs> you wanna terrorize humanity? No? You sure? <laughs> I could help. Okay. I think that's it. Synthesis Universe. Yeah, it definitely feels like a taster teaser type thing, but a lot of work in that. <laughs> nice exit command. That's kind of cool. All right, well. That is Synthesis Universe. Given the price point, it's like eight, what is it? The price point's eight, um, eight pounds, $10. I'd cut the price point in half, four pounds, $5. Um, seems fair for that, but there's a lot of work in it, but I can see why people would be like, hmm. So the positives about that are, um, yeah, definitely the, uh, it works back in really well with the sub pack, so. Go get yourself one of these bad boys if you have the money. There's a new one coming out called the X1, which doubles as a chair vibrator. So you strap it to the back of a chair, the back of a chair, you don't sit against it, which is really smart. Um, or it's a backpack like this one and it's controlled and there's loads of like low latency technology that works with that. So the Subpack X1 is definitely on my two by radar. Uh, anyway, that was that was pretty cool. That was Synthesis Universe. Um, yeah, I definitely suggest it's it's like um, it feels like content that's um, yeah. There's like a lot of other indie indie content that's that's like kind of like that, but is missing the polish. Like that has like an incredible amount of both audio landscape and visual like visual stimuli polish. The things I felt that were lacking uh, from the beginning 
it was like motion controller support wasn't obvious to me because things were coming up. Uh, and then there were little nodes that appeared later and I realized that I had at least some interaction. Um, but the fact that it's gaze-based interaction, that definitely took me down, like, out a notch. Um, and then, like, there's all these teasers of things that I kind of know in my heart that I probably will never see come to fruition, which is tough. That's definitely a difficult place to be, but um, I liked it. I had a good fun. <laughs>